Mohamed Salah equaled DDS Drogba's goal tally of 104, making him the joint top highest goal scorer African in the English Premier League. Sadio Mane joined the Premier League Club 100 as he netted his 100th goal against uh, Watford over the weekend. Salah scored a sumptuous goal once again, helping Liverpool thrash Watford 5-0. Manchester United lost their first ever away in 29 games in the Premier League after losing to Leicester City 4-2. Pressure mounting on Hooligan Solskjaer. Chelsea maintained top spot after a stellar goalkeeping display by Edward Mendy and gave them all three points versus a resilient Brentford. The Blues winning 1-0. Manchester City kept pace with the rest of the pack at the top after they beat Burnley 2-0 at home. Sergio Aguero in Spain made his debut for FC Barcelona since signing for them four months ago in a 3-1 win versus Valencia. Juventus beat Jose Mourinho's AS Roma in Italy 1-0. Bayern Munich thrashed second place by Leverkusen 5-1 in the Bundesliga. Welcome back to the channel. As usual, I am your host, Salah Sifiawe. And we're back from the international break. A really, really refreshing international break for me. I, I enjoyed the international break. Back to club football for Manchester United as a Manchester United fan. For them to be stressing me out and it started over the weekend as they lost 4-2 to leicester city onto the champions league versus atlanta on wednesday and it's not going to be easy at all well today we're going to talk about the performances of Ghanaian players abroad and we'll talk about the fact that andrea Ayew is the third highest goal scorer in the qatar stars league he netted his fifth goal over the weekend a camaldine sulemana is still flourishing and doing amazing things in the french league he scored an amazingly stupendous goal for his club side as they thrashed mets 3-0 we'll talk about them and other players in the premier league but don't forget to subscribe click on the notification bell as well without much ado let's jump right into the performances of Ghanaian players but before then Kumasi Asante got to drill 1-1 in their second preseason game a crowd to hook have it all to do despite winning 1-0 versus Wydad Casablanca at the Accra Sports Stadium on Sunday so uh, still hope for Accra to folk uh, we'll see what they can do on the 24th let's jump right into it and start off from England as we do and Leicester City's Daniel Amate was a stoic at the back for his club side Pocketing Cristiano Ronaldo as Manchester United lost 4 2 to Leicester City at the King Power Stadium. Amate played the full 90 minutes of the encounter. Southampton took on Leeds United, another man of the match display from Mohamed Salisu, uh, who the GFA president has revealed uh, talks are ongoing to convince him to come back to play for Ghana. Considering the fact that we will be missing out on Alexander Juku. Uh, Salisu would be a more than competent replacement. Uh, Brentford, uh, they took on Chelsea, a 1-0 loss to Brentford. Tariq Fosu still not in the Brentford side. He has not made a Premier League appearance since their promotion. And this is their eighth game in the Premier League. He however played in the Carabao Cup with them last time out. Tariq Fosu was not in the squad. Fulham took on QPR and Albert Adoma was an unused substitute for QPR in this game they lost 4-1 to Fulham a Reading took on Barnsley a stellar display by Abdul Babara Man 1-0 victory for his side Reading a Barnsley losing there and Yadom returned from injury he had missed the international break due to injury and could not make it uh, he was back playing 90 minutes for both Ghanaians a Crowley Town lost 1-0 to Sutton United a Kwesiapia played 90 minutes of the encounter aside losing their 1-0. Arsenal play Crystal Palace on Monday night football later today. In Spain, Real Sociedad took on RCD Mallorca. Idris Baba came on in the 76th minute of this encounter. His Mallorca side losing 1-0. Celta Vigo took on Sevilla. They lost 1-0. Josef Edu played 90 minutes of the encounter. In Germany, Frankfurt, they took on Hertha Berlin and Kevin Prince Boateng came on in the 83rd minute, his Hertha Berlin side winning 2-1. Grethefurth took on Bochum and Christopher Entriege was on a used substitute 
for Buckham. Hans Nunu Sape, a 90 minutes of action for Greta Forth. Heidenheim took on St. Pauli and Daniel Kofi Tre, who plays his football with St. Pauli, uh, was in action. He played a full 90 minutes in a 4 2 display win by his side, St. Pauli. In Italy, Spezia, they took on Salernitana and it was Emmanuel Jesse. He played 90 minutes, got a yellow card for his troubles. Spezia side uh, winning 2 1 on this occasion. Genoa drew 2 2 with Sassuolo and Kuban came on in the 32nd minute of this encounter. Venezia will play Fiorentina later today and the Ghanaian Alfred Duncan suspected to be in action. In France, Bordeaux took on Nantes and Gideon Mensa and a new substitute for his Bordeaux side. Osman Bukhari played 54 minutes of the encounter. Both teams shared the swells. It ended 1-1. Strasbourg took on St. Etienne, a 5-1 victory for Strasbourg and emphatic one. Alexander Juku following his injury uh, could not play this one. Majid Waris was an unused substitute. Metz uh, took on Star Ren and Kabaldin Sulemana played 68 minutes, scoring his goal and Ren's second goal in the 37th minute. An amazing goal by the young man who keeps impressing in the French league and his fourth goal of the season and this boy truly is special. The Mets losing 3-0 to start Ren in that game. Clermont Foot 63 took on Lille a 1-0 victory for Salis Abdul Samed's side who played 90 minutes of this encounter. In Turkey, Adanya Demispor uh, took on Yeni Malatispor. Benjamin Tete uh, played 79 minutes, scored in the 36th minute for his club side, uh, Yeni Malatispor. After his uh, time with the Black Stars, in which he could not find any luck with finding the back of the net, uh, he, however, uh, found his scoring boots again for Yeni Malatispor. Alanya Spor will take on Kayseri Spor, and Admensa will be in action for Kayseri Spor in that game. In the Netherlands, Herevin uh, took on Ajax uh, and it was a 2-0 victory for Ajax. Kudus Mohamed uh, played 63 minutes of uh, the encounter in this 2-0 win. In Poland, Gornik Zab Zabrez uh, took on Wisla Krakow. Yao Yebua, following his exploits to the Black Stars, came on in the 87th minute. And finally, in the Qatar Stars League, Ghanaian player Andre Ayu came on in the 66th minute and scored in the 89th minute for his club side outside as they thumped El Garrafa 6 4. Go feast there for Andre Ayu and his club side. So, those are the performances of Ghanaian players that I captured and followed over the weekend. Andre Ayu getting on the score sheet, continuing his goal scoring form for club and country. Akamaldin Sulemana amazing young talent kudus mohammed back in action for his club side ajax benjamin tete finding his scoring boots once again and it was a a great weekend good to have club football back champions league conference league europa league is all this week actually they are all happening this week which games are you looking forward to which games and throw you over the weekend i say the moment of the weekend was Mohamed Salah's 104th goal uh, to equal the year Drogba's record and surely he will surpass it. An amazing player, the world best at the moment in form of his life. Let me know your thoughts in the comments box at Liverpool, Chelsea, Manchester City, keep pace in the Premier League. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a great day. Enjoy the week.